up and down, and he has the ability to pitch backward. When you do get him down in the zone, that's when he does have a tendency to give up, you know, the big fly, the long ball. Last year, it's, it's a power-speed combination. You look, I mean, that's a big league body. Wozu through the left side. Lead off, base hit. Can get better, they can get more physical. Grounded to short, they're coming to third. Tag applied, and they get Wogu. For Tim Corbin's club, strike three. Hickman's out of the first. Knows them all pretty well, too. It's a big, strong kid. He attacks the strike zone. Um, he's really worked on his breaking ball. His changeup was his best pitch a year ago as a secondary pitch. Really has worked on his breaking ball this year. Good for him, even though he was pitching for Team USA because they thought it was such a great story. Chriswell works his way back and punches out Cooper Davis for out number one in the first. For this lineup, I mean, program records in several offensive categories. Still steadying defensive presence there at shortstop. So even though it's a new look, these guys are pretty talented too. And if you've watched him on MLB Network, you've never seen him make it out because he went three for three, almost hit for the cycle, and drew three walks last year when we did this game. Give him the hit sign. Yep. Grounded to short. Blomgren high throw, but Schmidt gets down, but the runner does score. Watch list. Every program gets three. Heading into a campaign as Thomas with a base hit. Hustling to second base. Thomas slides in safely. Despite my best efforts. Steven Nelson is mine. Is, there's strike three. Finally, Chris Well out of the inning, but he did think along. I mean, he's not only playing. He, there you go. Strike three from Mason Hickman gets out of the second. Al, do you want to go? With changing speeds, a couple different secondary pitches. So, pitcher. Swinging strikeout for Chris Well. Another two. quick one. In the second, Al. Ball smoke. Smacked into right. Will it get down off the base of the wall? Cooper Davis. Extra bases. Stand up double. On Martin. Puts the barrel on it. But softly floats in the center. Work could be snagged by Wogu. In terms of facilities and Rockies and Diamondbacks. Uh, you know, they do everything to make the kids feel good. You get, but just a, a wonderful guy, just a kind of a a man's man uh, that really loved the game, really loved his kids. And high school, at Boston Celtics head coach Brad Stevens went to. Takes a hack at it. Oh, what a pick by Harrison Ray to Carter Young. They cannot turn two. Throw gets by Jones. Coming home is Blomgren. He'll slide in. We're tied up at one. The three outfielders that can make plays. They have four infielders can make plays. There's a nice pickoff to get out of it. But, you know, another strong team, just new faces. How difficult is that challenge to. Justin Henry Malloy, designated hitter, kind of jammed there over to Nate or to Matt Schmidt. He steps on first. He's pulling it back in. I don't think he's missing too many pitches behind the plate. Great and, at bat. And Schmidt. Pays it off with a base hit to left field. He's turning, heading for second, slides in safely. Last year, Hickman started the third and final game. Skied in a shallow left center. Cooper Davis drifts over. Who had this vision to build it back, you know, a while ago now? Yeah, we're, we're entering our 10th season on the outside of Pearl Harbor. The Salt River uh, community got the piece. And years. it's a high tempo delivery. Very, and you can see that on the first pitch. There's a lot of energy in his delivery. Wogu pulls it into left field for a leadoff single. He pay things off. He will. Wangren swings through strike three as Wogu heads down to second. Now the 3 2. Swing and a miss. Now the 0 2. Grounder underneath Jones in the right field. Austin Goss Stadium a bunch to watch them play. Runner going. Rodriguez down to third. Martin plays the tag. Safe. Let's see what Matt Schmidt can do. Doubled his last time up. Ball bounces away from Rodriguez. 2 1. Michigan has the lead. Schmidt kind of caught in between there, it seemed. We have more action in the Vandy pen. As Smith's 1 0. Taken the other way into the gap. Did you? No, at the base of the wall, though. 
So an easy double for Obertop. Burton to Young. And that's it. That's where it starts right there. And we don't we pay attention to detail. I think I'm anxious to see what he takes into the game tomorrow. No, I am too. And I mean Kumar with a changeup would almost be unfair because you got taking over in relief for Michigan. Cameron Weston from Nolan pulls it through the right side. Corbin Sendon Jones tied at two. The freshman is a pinch hitter. I bet he goes breaking ball here. Ready, ready one one drops down the bunt. Play at home. There is no play. Three two Vandy boys. With two in the frame. Three two in the game. So the left hander Ben Kaiser. Management. Top to the left side. Charging in. Blomgren throw to first pick by Schmidt. On the mound, pitched in a ton of big games. Mentally tough kid, loves these situations. This He's got a changeup too. He's going to be a pro reliever, I think, but probably starts at a lot of schools. Jack Blomgren swings at the first pitch. All right now the focus on JD as they call him. Brown. Paints the corner, strike three, out number two. Down toward a third strike. The 0-2 rings him up. Sophomore outfielder. Shoots it the other way. That's trouble. Off the wall and right. He's got second easy. Does he want three? No, he'll stand up. To the season. Spencer Jones, big target. At 6'7", 215, he wears it, takes his base. Defense replacement had two at-bats last year. It still doesn't have a college hit. He went back to it, and it worked. Yeah, it wasn't me. Good Elliott. Piece of hitting right there. The freshman goes to the opposite field. Freshman on first, Redshirt senior at the plate. He got it. Matt Schmidt, did you? Oh, my. With the slider. Look at the pitch right here. It was a fastball. Left it middle of the plate. Great swing, great extension. It was right on the pitch. Hit that ball a long way. Energy like that. He got thrown out of the game. Arguing a strike call there. I'm not sure what led to that, but uh, he rung him up right there and threw him out of the game. Jimmy Overtrop. Eric Backich wants an explanation from Ramon Armendaris. Uh, for Beach, California. We'll step in, facing an 0-2 count. That's tough duty, right? Yeah, there. That's, that's <laughs> a different style than Kumar Rocker. He's more kind of average to fringy stuff and good command and <laughs> living right, right there. Line drive smoke right at his shortstop. That was a loud out. Watch. <laughs> the, the pause afterwards. Can base pretty quickly. 3 2. Nub down the line. Burton charges, throws across the diamond. That's a freshman, folks. Same one that produced Mark McGuire. Here's the 1-1. One -one. Davis pulls a bunt to the right side. And he beats the throw out. Bunt single with two outs. Page comes with the 2-1. And it hits C.J. Rodriguez. That hit him. The bases are loaded for the Vandy boys. Isaiah versus Isaiah. Page in the center, tracking back to right center. Bullock makes the catch. Wolverines open 2020 with a win.